Steve Munson's friends think he has the best job in the world. The University of Missouri graduate student is making wine. MU just began an experimental winery to test grape varieties and growing practices in Missouri. Wine making seems like a pretty sexy job when you hear people are looking at it from the outside, but uh, there's a reason I'm not wearing a button-up shirt right now. Working with grapes is no easy job. I go to work and I get wet, dirty, um, stained. You can't like any of the clothes that you wear to work. Growing better grapes in Missouri is important, but the bigger goal is to grow the wine industry in Missouri. The director of the MU Institute for Continental Climate, Viticulture, and Enology says there are 92 wineries in Missouri. That's twice as many as there were four years ago. There's been tremendous growth. Uh, each one of those wineries that uh, is out there uh, is an economic engine for its region. Researchers at the MU Experimental Winery will look at grape varieties that may have been overlooked. The experimental wines will be analyzed in the lab and tasted by industry professionals. If we can get a variety that had absolutely wonderful fruit characteristics and wine characteristics and you didn't have to uh, spray it at all, that's the ideal situation that we're looking for. Grape growers won't have to gamble on untested varieties. You know, this is information that we can share with the entire industry here and uh, provide them with the knowledge without investing hundreds of thousands of dollars. Looking ahead, MU plans to produce its own signature wine. I really think that there will be a characteristic MU wine that we can show the world that will represent the university, hopefully before I graduate. From the University of Missouri, I'm Kent Faddis reporting.